Representative Cantrell. Thank you, Mr. Chair. And um, I really first want to start out by commending you all on, on your efforts around this legislation. I know it's not easy. Um, I want to endorse your position because I did uh, support Representative Sims' bill last session. I cannot endorse your bill today because I haven't seen it, and I, and I know you all understand that. But I do want to speak in favor of, of your position and really commend you all for, for the hard work that you've done. Um, you know, you're my colleague from Jefferson. Representative St. Ange is my is my seatmate on the House floor. So I, I've seen your you know your all's evolution on this issue personally, and and want to commend you all for everything you're doing. You know, for patients, for children, for families, who 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 have you know all the different conditions that um, that could move the needle on um, on health care and uh, alleviating pain and symptoms in our state. Um, I, I was going to ask a question of. Uh, Representative St. Ange and, and Representative Nemus, you sort of uh, got into it a little bit when you answered Representative Moser's question on revenue. You've, you've sort of detailed that this isn't expected to be a big money maker. Are you thinking about treating it like a prescription drug and, and not taxing it to the end user? Or um, are you thinking about it's just you're just not going to tax it enough where we can expect um, a lot of revenue generation? Right. Well, well the, the purpose as a representative, um, thank you for, for your support when you read the bill. Um, um, th he mentioned the uh, excise tax or wholesale tax on that. Um, the, the production of that, anything that would be um, left over from that would go, and we have this outlined in the bill, into various um, different areas, one of which would be into law enforcement to help with their um, what they have to do to get up to speed with all of this. Um, but as far as taxing it, um, that is something that we're still working on exactly which areas and um, and whether it's going to follow a model of prescription or follow some other model. But the the purpose and what I think he was trying to um, suggest and to and to actually um, our intent is that it's not a money maker. If we want the businesses to succeed, absolutely. We believe in free market enterprise. We want the business to succeed. But a lot of times people get it confused. I know you don't, Representative Cantrell, but a lot of times people do confuse. Oh, marijuana, you're going to legalize marijuana. Great. We've got a lot of money. We, you know, we'll be able to solve you know, any deficit that we may have, that we do have. Um, that's not what this bill is intended to do. Um, and I think that's what he's going to say. Speaking to the specifics of it, we can get back to you on that. Right. I, I hope I hope you will. There's there's just a lot of different ways to do it along the way because of the way that this product would be produced. There's a lot of different ways to tax it along the way, or you right. can you can have that passed along to the end user, or you can have that end user you know pay pay a certain amount. And I, I think it all depends on how you want to treat it. And we're trying to make it affordable. One of this is that we're trying to make it affordable to the people who cannot afford to purchase this because there's no insurance that covers. And they cannot afford to go in and, and um, um, you know, pay exorbitant fees, a, a little bit of which I addressed at the, on the cost issue for the people who are more remotely located. It certainly sounds like it would be affordable to this family, is, is um, you know, that's and that's very persuasive evidence in your all's favor. Thank you, Mr. Chair. If I could just real quick, um, we could make a billion dollars off this. The problem is who's paying it? We don't want to make money off the back of folks who need to be helped. And so that's why we could tax it to the hilt, but we've decided not to because we want it accessible. 